right. My name's Nick Fernandez. And as a child, I was confused by the term nickname. I know you're wondering why I'm here. I am technically Asian. I'm half Indian, half Italian. But for some reason, when you combine them, you get Persian. That's right. I never had a nickname until I went to university and I moved into a residence with four other Nicks. We had to do some organizing. Luckily, one of the Nicks was a real homebody, never left his room. Problem solved. We're left with four Nicks. Two of these Nicks were white. One of these white Nicks was really nice. So we called him Nice Nick, and the other one, White Nick. Don't overthink it. We're left with two Nicks. Both of us happen to be brown. The other brown Nick was really naggy to his roommate about keeping everything clean and tidy. So we called him Mom. And that left me as Tits Nick. That's right, I spent eight months of my university career with the nickname Tits Nick because my nipples stick out more than they should. They're like Hershey's Kisses wrapped in puff pastry and baked to perfection. Just the perfect color brown. Now you're picturing it. And I'm half Indian, half Italian. Those are two very hairy cultures. And when you, you combine that DNA, it doesn't add, it multiplies. And my chest hair is very elliptical in nature. And so it kind of looks like two hurricanes battling it out with my nipple volcanoes in the eyes of the storm. I'm just trying to live my life. That's right. I also look way older uh, than I am. Uh, I've been told by way too many people that I kind of have a divorced dad energy. But like on the weekend, he doesn't have his kids. <laughs> just hung over on a Sunday. I'm 23. Right. That hurts just a little. It hurts a little. Yeah. The thing about people my age, it's hard for me to relate to them because they have a lot of attitude. And I, it, it's hard because I, I think that we don't really have any, any base anymore, any rock solid foundation. We don't have religion. We worship material things, technology, food. Right? That's what we got. That's our holy trinity. Right? And I was raised Catholic, and to be honest, sometimes I miss going to church. But not for like the major things, like the guilt and the lecturing. I, I miss it for the little things. Like when the priest would sing the prayer. You know what I'm talking about? He's like, the body of Christ. You know, show off his range. He has a captive audience, right? And uh, I, I, the thing I liked about that is at, at the end of that, everyone in the audience, uh, you know, in the congregation, would go, amen, together. And that was like a spiritual moment. It made you feel connected to the people around you. And I miss that sometimes. So I put something together that we can all do, but I'm going to take God out of it. You guys will know what to say. This soup that is made by first sauteing pieces of meat and then put in a really hot broth with noodles. Ramen. <laughs> this soup that is way too expensive considering the price of the individual ingredients. 
Ramen. My God, you guys harmonized there. <laughs> These guys that do lots of steroids and work out a lot so that they can wrestle on Monday nights for pay. Ramen. That was a WWE joke. That was what that was. <laughs> These guys that are super ardent followers of the Egyptian god of the sun. Ramen. Thank you guys. Yeah. Nick Fernandez. <laughs>